Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great pre-owned travel trailer value from Parkway RV Center. And today we're going to look at a 2017 Forest River Wildwood 27 RKSS. Folks, it's a 31 and a half foot travel trailer. Shows very, and I mean very little use. Uh, really nice. Got one big slide out. It's a, the perfect couple's floor plan. It's a rear kitchen model. You don't hardly see that many of them. Looking around it, folks, I mean, it's really hard to pick this one. Got outside speakers. Got a, It's got the power package, which includes the power awning with LED lights. Includes the power stabilizer jacks and the power front tongue jack. Spare tire on the back. Got a six-gallon DSI water heater. Corners aren't beat up. This camper's been used very little since the day it was built, folks. And you can just look through it and see that really quickly. Got a big slide out, super slide. Of course, I'm hooked on the generator power right now. It's a nice camper, folks. You know, 31 and a half foot, it weighs 6,400 and 93 pounds, so under 6,500 pounds. Got the smooth fiberglass cap on the front. You know, this is in range of majority of half ton trucks and, and full size SUVs. Interstate battery on the front, two 30 pound propane bottles. It, is, it does have the, it's got the solar ready Z amp package. And I do have the Z amp solar panels. All you gotta do is and you can not opt for sale. All you got to do is purchase them and set them up, plug it right into the camper, and you've got solar power. Sixty-five hundred or sixty-four ninety-three. I mean, we can definitely call it sixty-five hundred, just for sake of argument, a little easier to remember. Thirty-inch wide door, screen, everything looks great. Triple steps going into it. Which is really nice because it's got a good height clearance in case you've got something like a Ram pickup or something that sets up a little taller than your average uh, your average pickup truck or full-size SUV. I love the rear kitchen floor plan for couples, folks. Now, I know this isn't going to sleep a family of eight, but it can still sleep six people. And you get so much room back here in this rear kitchen. You know, I like to cook a lot. And that's one thing me and my wife both do in our motor home is we do cook a lot when we take it out. So I like having a big kitchen, plenty of food prep area. And the, what I like about a rear kitchen the most, when you're back here cooking or preparing food, nobody has a reason to walk around you. You've got your own little private area back here. Solid surface countertops, a really nice touch. You don't hardly see that on travel trailers. I love this faucet. I mean, that, I don't know if that's factory or not, but that's a, that's a cool faucet. Stainless steel appliances. Uh, Dometic, 8 cubic foot refrigerator freezer. Got a stainless steel microwave. You know, I know this thing's got this beautiful rear kitchen, but it doesn't look like they've ever cooked in it, folks. Those stove eyes show no use, or no use at all. I mean, this whole camper, folks, shows very little use. Got the little, I guess it's like an etched glass or glass ca uh, cabinet fronts got the little uh, backsplash it looks good got plenty of plug-ins back here plenty of cabinets and drawer space silverware drawer you don't hardly see that either pretty neat folks nice pantry it does have the stereo with the surround sound which works Got a table booth that makes a bed. You've got a leather sleeper sofa. And with this big rear kitchen, if you need to put an air mattress back here to sleep a couple more people, you can. Uh, but it can sleep six on paper, but you got room for an air mattress if you need to sleep another couple. Um, two leather chairs, recliners. TV, I've got it on. It's got the bedroom TV, too. I uh, got the drive stereo. This is a Bluetooth CD DVD player. Obviously works, got USB hookups, all that, so you can charge your phone. 
day night shades in all the windows it, it's only got carpet right here in the main slide out in the front bedroom so you got linoleum floor which looks like hardwood in all the main traffic areas so that's going to really hold up well and a lot easier to keep clean got the side bathroom over here you got a uh, RV toilet medicine cabinet I really like this shower too it's got the magnetic doors and with the safety strap too but these you don't have a catch to worry about it's a magnetic catch and this shower shows very little use and the best way to tell look down there at the sticker down below and uh, you can see it's looks like it's never even been wet those stickers get worn out very quickly folks people take showers they get it gets wet and dry people rub it with their feet those stickers don't last long at all and the fact that it still looks like that tells me this camper has been used very very little got a skylight and you can look around it folks no sign of water damage Everything's enclosed here on the side, so while you're getting ready, everybody's got full access to the entire camper. I like the LED lights, interior lights too. Front bedroom, got a Queen Island bed. Got a bigger TV in here as well. I don't think that's factory. I think somebody's added that, but it's nice that they left it in there. I mean, that's probably a good 28 or 32 inch TV in the bedroom. Of course, remote control, Queen Island bed mini closets windows got dirty clothes chute right here what you do is you from your outside compartment you put your dirty uh, a dirty clothes hamper in there and you got a place to dump your dirty clothes plus there's storage underneath the bed LED lights in here of course not bad a lot of camper folks Very well equipped, got the Dometic 13,500 BTU ducted roof air, got the ducted furnace. You know, what I like about this floor plan, especially for somebody who's going to be using this more than just taking it to the lake for the weekend, this is a good floor plan if you're needing one for temporary or permanent home. This is something that a couple of people can live in and have plenty of room. Um and not be as cramped. Of course, I know when you live in an RV, you're going to have to make some cutbacks. You know, you can't have your everything in here, but um, as far as your stuff, but this is something you can definitely grow with. And anyway, it's only $17,900, folks. For 17, less than two years old, use very little. 17.9. I mean, if you bought this thing brand new, folks, you would owe quite a bit more than that on it. Uh, if you financed it when you bought it new, paid 10% down like you're supposed to and and, uh, and paid on it for two years, you, you couldn't afford to sell it for what we're selling this one for. $17,900. Here's what all you get for that price. You get this absolutely beautiful 2017 Wildwood by Forest River. 27 RKSS, 31 and a half foot long, 6493 dry weight. Um, it's going to be completely checked out by my certified RV techs. We're going to go through it. We're going to go through an extensive RV component checkout. If you want a copy of all the systems that we guarantee and will inspect and guarantee to work for the price you pay, contact my sales department. They'll be happy to email you or fax you a copy of that list and go over it with you after you receive a copy of it and answer any questions you have about what it covers, what it doesn't cover. But, folks, we've already checked the major systems on this RV. We know the fridge, the air, the awning, the lights, the TVs, the slide-outs, the jacks, and the, and the tongue jack works perfectly. We already checked all that out. So you don't have to worry about that not working because it does. However, uh, we're going to take it one step farther. We're going to check the water system, the propane system, the converter, the electrical system, the batteries system, the 12 volt system, and more. Like I said, if you want a copy of all the things that we inspect and repair if needed at no additional cost to you. In other words, folks, that 17.9 price is guaranteed. It doesn't go up because we spent more than we planned on checking this camper out. I mean, this check, this camper will be checked out, everything on that list functioning perfectly, ready to go, $17,900, no surprises, no games or gimmicks. 
no extra fees. It's seventeen nine plus sales tax, uh, applicable sales tax. If you've got a question, how much your sales tax will be, when and where you have to pay it, sales tax laws vary from state to state, and they're by no means universal. Please call my sales department, tell them where you live, how you're paying for it, and they'll get you an accurate sales tax um, estimate. So there's no surprises there for anyone. And they'll also tell you what the current lead time is for a travel trailer checkout, which shouldn't take more right now in more than a few days. But call ahead because that could change from the time you see this, from the time this video was shot to the time that you actually buy this camper. The time frame for a checkout will probably be different. More, maybe less. It's hard to say. Anyway, folks, 17.9, you're going to get all of that. And after this unit's been checked out and then my cleaning crew gets a hold of it, we clean it inside and out. Uh, it gets locked up so nobody else can go in it and mess around with it, have their kids running around in it, spilling stuff in it, tearing stuff up. After it's been checked out, my service manager, Gordy, does his final walkthrough. He's going to call, and he's satisfied with it. He's going to lock it back up, call you to set up an appointment for you to pick up your camper. Once you arrive here at the appointed time, the RV tech that checked it out knows it better than anybody. It's going to spend some one-on-one -on -one time with you and, and show you how to operate everything on our list. Answer any questions you have. You can record them with your phone, with your camera. Uh, give you tips, tricks, and pointers. Show you any repairs you had to make. And much more. And all that's included for that seventeen nine price. But I'm not stopping right there. Seventeen thousand nine hundred dollars, which is a bargain for this camper if you look them up online. And I'm gonna do something that nobody else does either. You're also going to get a ninety day nationwide limited warranty. This is this warranty isn't through us, folks. This is actually a service contract that we purchase in your name that has a network of dealers nationwide that take it. So in case, for those of you who are purchasing this unit that live far away from us, you don't have to worry in the, in the rare occasion that you would need to take a 17 model back for warranty repair in the first 90 days. You've got options of where you can take it to while you're always welcome to take it here. That's why we purchased that RV. So if you live 1,500 miles away from us, you don't have to haul it 1,500 miles for a $200 repair. I mean, you can take it to another dealer that's closer to you in that network. And that's included, 90-day nationwide limited warranty included. You also get 21 nights of free camping because we know the first thing you're going to want to do when you buy your new-to-you camper is take it somewhere and use it and show it off. We give you 21 nights of camping in a 12-month period, absolutely free at select RV resorts nationwide up to seven nights at a time. That's included, folks. That's $1,000 worth of free camping. You get all of that for one of the lowest prices on the internet for 2017 uh, Wildwood 27 RKSS. And those other pr dealers that price these things for 23, 24 grand, they include none of that stuff. We include all of that for 17.9 plus plus applicable sales tax, haggle free firm. We, our prices were one price store, no fees, no surprises, no haggling. The price is what it is. It's if you want this camper with all the features and that we give you that I just described, that's the price. I'm not going to take a dime less for it, folks. I don't even please don't even ask. I don't take offers. You know, you don't when you go to Walmart buy a TV or, or you don't you don't sit there and negotiate the price and we don't believe you should do it with campers either. You know, if we want to haggle, we'll price this thing 24-9, we'll start haggling. But if you want to know what it takes to buy it, it's 17-9. That's the way we've done it for years now. That's the way customers, our customers love it because everybody hates haggling. Nobody likes doing research and, and all that stuff, folks. We do the research. We have third-party software that tells us the average price of this camper on the Internet. And we beat that price and give you all those other benefits as well. Maybe that's why we've been in business for 50 years now, folks. Um, we don't play around. We sell campers, and we sell them quick. Um, you know, if I keep most campers like this, probably won't last a week. And thanks to the Internet, there's no such thing as a local shopper no more. People travel from all over the country. So, you know, it's not like it was 20 years ago where you just went to your local RV dealership and bought from them, no one had no idea, nothing to compare it to, if it was a good buy or not. Now you've got more resources than people could ever dream about on the internet. 
and uh, of course that's a two-edged sword because you have those resources so does everybody else and when you find a good buy like this uh, other potential shoppers are going to want to buy it too so it's kind of like a rat race first one here gets it but 17 nines a price now i do offer what we call an option b price and option b is the only way we discount our prices folks option b is you buy this camper just like you see in this video you know we've already checked the major stuff on it we know it works but we don't guarantee it the as is price is no warranty uh taking it just like it is no inspection no demonstration no cleanup we're going to clean the writing off the windows bring your room in you're going to hook it to your vehicle and go um, you're not going to get a warranty you're not going to get any free camping you're not going to get a walkthrough demonstration it's just jump in it and go the only thing you're going to get is the camper a drive out 45 day drive out tag no additional charge and a uh, bucket a starter kit bucket with your sewer hose water hose and pressure reducer which you also get with option a as well that's it and of course uh, we'll give you an instructional dvd to watch from in here or at home so you get an idea how to operate it and if you can buy one under those conditions we'll certainly give you a discounted price uh, advantages of option B over option A are pretty obvious. You get a lower price off an already incredibly low asking price. And you get to take it home the same day you pay for it. You don't have to wait for an inspection. So if you can buy one under those conditions, as long as you understand as is means you, the buyer, if you do option B, are 100% responsible for any current or future repairs that this camper needs or may need. And as long as you can understand that, there's no excluded systems to that then we'll certainly sell it to you as is. Here, here's my recommendation, folks. As nice as this camper is, it's still a two-year-old used camper, which I know doesn't sound like much, but if you can come look at it, come look at it, folks. It's so much easier. Just treat it like you would any used vehicle. Um, if you can, if, you, if your schedule permits, come look at it, spend some time with it, get to know it a little bit before you decide if this is the one for you. Uh, you know, we'll hook it up to a generator, we'll run power to it, let you spend some time in it, do your own inspection if you want to, um, and then decide if you want to do option A or B. Now, I know not everybody can do that, and if I was going to buy one side unseen, I mean, this would be a pretty good choice. I mean, it shows so little use in it, and there's no smoke or pet odors either. So if I was going to buy one side unseen, this would be a dang good one to do. And if, you know, if we can help you buy one side unseen, we sell a couple of hundred of these a year to people we never even meet that don't know what they purchased. They already pay for it. They get it checked out or don't get it checked out. Depends on what option they do. They pay somebody to ship it to them. They don't know what they bought until it comes up their driveway after they paid for it. Um, but if you want to buy one like that while we prefer to shake your hand and meet you in person before we decide to buy it we understand everybody's schedules are different not everybody can take off especially if you live a distance from us like many of our customers do not everybody can take off and do that so you know we don't mind sending you additional pictures custom videos just let your salesperson know what you want to see in those pictures and videos we'll do it we, you know, we'll, we can even recommend some third-party inspection services that would do an unbiased inspection. Now, how many dealers can uh, tell you that? We want you to be sure this is you before you buy it. We don't want buyer's remorse. You know, we sell five to 600 used campers and RVs and fifth wheels a year. I mean, uh, you know, we, don't, we, we want to make everybody as happy as we possibly can within reason. Uh, it is used as nice as it is. I don't see it, but I'm sure it's got a wear and tear somewhere. <laughs> but um, please keep that in mind with an open mind. This is a used camper, not new. It's not priced for a new one. It's priced way under a new one. And um, and you don't have to pay all those fees like a new one or a used one at other dealerships. Folks, I was talking to a guy the other day. He paid over $4,000 in fees on a $14,000 camper at another RV dealership. That's not counting sales tax. That's just dock fees, prep fees, tag and title fees, setup fees, freight fees, and all this other junk that they charge on a 14 grand camper. So, um, and of course, he had no idea that all that stuff was dealer profit. He thought that was something that everybody did because that's what his salesperson told him. Well, folks, don't pay those fees just, just walk out don't buy a camper if they try to charge you anything besides the sales price and sales tax unless you're buying something like an extended warranty or something like that so 
keep that in mind, folks. Uh, the only thing we charge at Parkway RV Center is price, sales tax. That's it. Got any questions? Our phone lines are open, 706-965-7929. They're answered 24 hours a day, seven days a week. After hours, we have an answering service, and if they can't help you, they will get your contact info and forward it to our sales teams. Or come out and visit us, folks. Located at 5568 Battlefield Parkway, Ringgold, Georgia. Uh, we're about 10 miles south of Chattanooga, Tennessee, about an hour and a half north of Atlanta, right off Interstate 75. We're about a mile off the exit, easy to get to. Um, visit our website, parkwayrbcenter.com. If you don't want to type it in your address bar, that's no problem. Go to my video description. I'll have a link to our used travel trailer page in the first paragraph of the video description. Click on that, and you can go right to this camper if you want to. I'll have some really neat benefits and information that you do not find on the YouTube video, including a factory brochure that you can um, download in PDF on your computer, and you'll know more about it than I do and anybody else. I'll have weights, tank capacities, pictures, trade-in appraisal forms, credit applications, and much more on our website, parkwayrvcenter.com. Or if you are on YouTube, click on the video description and click on the link. Easy as that, folks. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button, folks. Um, I try to post videos every day. And, you know, we get buys like this all the time. I mean, we're, we've got a 50-plus year reputation as having the lowest prices in the country on used RVs. And, and we do our best to hold up to that reputation. And I think we do a great job. Um, Go through some of my past videos. Look at some of the prices. Of course, those RVs are long gone, but uh, look at some of the prices I've sold these things for. I mean, it's it's unreal how much money we can save you, and that's why people are willing to travel hundreds, sometimes thousands of miles to buy from us. Anyway, folks, uh, phone number one more time, 706-965-7929. Uh, you can email us, sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. Also, if you go to our website, folks, check out my, I've got a third-party service, a, a live operator chat and text feature that can help you out as well for a quick question. If they can't help you out, of course, they will forward it to our sales team who will contact you the, the same or the next business day. Or the best way to do is pick up the phone and call us. But I do have multiple options to contact us. Um... Nationwide deliveries available, financing's available with approved credit and minimum 10% down payment. Cash or trade equity is mandatory on all finance, uh, all finance deals. Not my rules, that's the banks. Unfortunately, I'm like you, I'm at the beck and call and the mercy of the banks. They're the ones with the money, not me. So, um, But we try to do our best to get everybody approved that we possibly can. I know RVs are tricky to approve. Um, you know, these are more like... A RV loan is more like a house loan than a car loan, so they're a little bit harder to get. Uh, this is a want, not a need. The banks know that. They're a luxury item, like buying a houseboat or a motorcycle or something like that, so keep that in mind. Um, don't be... I don't want anybody to get mad if they couldn't get approved for financing because about one-third of people that apply, and that's not just average for us. That's pretty much an industry average. One-third of everybody that applies for an RV loan, whether here and most other RV dealerships, get turned down for one reason or another maybe credit score maybe debt to income ratio which lately seems to be an issue um debt to income ratio for those of you who don't know is a is is just as much of a deciding factor on a loan as your credit history and credit score um that is how much you got coming out in payments every month to what you have coming in for income and most rb uh, you've got to be 40% and under most of the time for an RV loan because these are, like I said, a want, not a need. But we'll do our best, folks. We'll work with your own bank or credit union as well. We don't mark interest rates up like other dealers do. You go to a dealership's finance department, they're making money off of you on the financing too by marking the interest rate up. We don't have to worry about that here and much more. So thank you for watching my video. Come out and visit us, folks. You're going to love what you see. I've got a great selection of used travel trailers, and I've got brand new prowlers, too, So, which is another well-known brand that's been in business for 50 years, just like we have. 
So give us a call, 706-965-7929. Go to my website, parkwayrvcenter.com. Like us on Facebook. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hit the thumbs up button. Look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.